Hello, hello, it's Chase again. Welcome to another story of the SOSC. Now, fair warning, this isn't a main story that I'm about to tell you. Think of this as a bridge between the last story and the next big story, which is even crazier. But a bunch of things on the island have changed and I need to catch you up. The island is way different. The chrome is gone, I, I think. The only thing now is I don't have a house and there's a lot to explore on the island. But in this short story, with the chief not being here, he did leave us some missions that we have to complete. Agent Lou, Agent Dog, and Agent GX need to head to a new location to check out whatever slap juice is. Agent Red and Agent Z need to meet up with a secret contact to upgrade some weapons. And Agent Slaw and I, we are at an SOSC cabin, waiting for further orders. This should be fun. Hey, I'm back. Where did you go? Oh, well, since the SOSC put us in this cabin for two days, I tried going fishing, but uh, I forgot that it's only just ice out there. Oh, well, that makes sense. Are you ready for the mission? Yeah, of course. Uh, what's the mission? Oh, yeah. We're waiting for Agent IA to call us. Okay. Also, since we're staying here for another night, you can take the bed for tonight. What? Where are you going to sleep? The floor. Last night, you kept kicking me in your sleep. But I didn't see I don't care if we're in the cold. I can't do it. But I'll be cold. Well, I won't have bruises on me from your kicking. I have your mission details. All right, let's hear it. The DSA headquarters has a side sector that holds something we need, but it's guarded by a bunch of guards, or should be. Well, what is this something we need? You guys need to obtain the shockwave hammer. We need it for upcoming missions. What does it look like? It's a big purple hammer. I'll send you the coordinates to the sector. Get there, find it, take it, and return it back to the SOSC cabin. Will do. All right, let's go. Whoa, look, the sign spins! Let me be happy, Agent Dog! Alright, so what do we do first? Alright then, let's go. Hey, I'm walking in! Oh my god, is that a tattoo parlor? Uh, I think so. Why? Well, alright then. You go that way, I'll go this way, and just look for the hammer and let's try to get out of here as fast as possible. Dude. Uh, sorry. You find anything? No, and I don't think anyone is even here. Well, now what? Maybe upstairs? Let's check. Oh my god, there it is! Okay, stay right here and keep watch. I'll grab it and we'll go. No one's here though, it is he? We don't know that. Just just watch. I'll get it. Okay, I got it. Let's go. Uh what? There's a a man here? Oh, hello. <laughs> Did you hear that? Um...
Well, this is not creepy at all. Stop being scared, Agent Red. I'm far from scared. It's just a weird spot to meet at. Who are we even supposed to be meeting? Some guy named Jamadori Munietti. I don't know. That's what Agent Aya said. That is correct. You can call me Jam. The word you moan or Yeti if you would like. Yeah, I'm gonna just call you JM. That's Miss JM. Okay, Miss JM. The third. Anyways, you're our contact, right? I might be for a price. What? We don't have any money. Who said anything about money? I want something else. Which is. No. Um, we aren't. We can't. Not from you. You guys aren't even attractive. Hey, I'm very attractive, I'll have you know. Really? Then why do you have a mask on? I swear to you. Anyways, what exactly do you mean? Well, you're here because you want me to upgrade your weapon. Yeah? Well, I want you to find new dates so I can upgrade my love life. You're joking, right? Does it look like I'm joking? Well, your last name is Mo Monia Tana? Mon a Yeti. Mon Yeti. Mon we get it. The third. Okay, anyways, we will find you a date. Just please upgrade these weapons. You have a deal. We'll be back later to get them. I have to go. What? Where? I have to make something for someone. Oh, is it for me? No. No, it's not. It's okay. You can just surprise me later. Whatever you say. Ha! So I'm right. So, um, who are you? Oh, I'm John. Where is that coming from? Wait, so why are you up here? Well, I was buying some chocolate for my girlfriend and this guy got mad because it's the last box. So he took me and now I'm here. I'm so confused. Okay, we need to help you get out of here. Really? Please do. I was going to propose to my girlfriend. Her name's Linda. She's kind of the love of my life. Aww. All right, we're going to get you out of here, John. I'm Agency. This is Agent Slaw. Let's come with us. Wait. How should I propose? On one knee or on top of a chair? A chair. Really? I don't know. Like, spice it up a bit? Okay. Uh, anyways, let's go. Whoa. This must be the place where they package everything. Well, where do we find some? I don't know. Let's look down here. Maybe there's something laying around. Hey! Oh, hey. Who are you? Uh, who are you? Oh, I'm- Dude. Don't reveal all your info. Oh, I wasn't. I forgot my name anyways. Uh, I have to go. Nice meeting you. Wait, got a few questions. Get away. Whoa, whoa, hey, it's not that serious. I know what you guys are doing. You're trying to play dumb with me. Well, Agent Lou. Hey, wait a second. Are you calling me dumb? Anyways, I just wanted to know what slap juice was. There is. Stop it. You're not going to stop me from completing my mission. Mission? Who the heck was that? DSA maybe? There's no way that was a DSA agent. They were wearing what? yellow, not blue. Do you think there's another organization out there? I really hope not. Anyways, let's get some of this juice and get out of here. Uh-oh. Hey man, we're just hey, here to- Hey, Agent Sonny's in charge. No sudden movement, so I will suit. You too. Crouch down where you are. And you, take two steps towards me. Look, dude, we don't want any issues. You agent C, aren't you? Uh, yeah, how, how did you know? Agent Locke has told me a lot about you. Agent Locke? Who is that? You guys met on the bridge not too long ago. 
him? How does he know me? Who even is he? It's not my business to tell. You guys are coming with me. No questions asked. I have a question. It's just one. So, um, what did this Agent Locke tell you about me? No, no questions. Okay, can I just itch my arm really quick? Well, I suppose so. Agent Locke, now! Ha, you won't shoot me. You know, I'm not, but I'm gonna leave now. You're gonna stay here and act like nothing happened. Fine, I can't eliminate you anyways. And why not? He's special, according to a lot of people. So fine, you can go. Special? Ugh, I'm, just, I'm just gonna go. This isn't over. And after somehow getting the hammer, everybody completed their missions. Now, as we transition into the next day, Agent Red needed me for something. Okay. You can turn around now. Uh, why are we at a random person's house? I built it. Oh, wow. Really? Yep, and it's for you. Wait. What? Yeah, I stayed up all night until this morning. Being a lumberjack came in handy. Whoa. Follow me, guys. This house has everything you need, a bed, and there's a couch for agents allowed to sleep on. Of course, a kitchen, and then if you follow me over here, you have a storage. And all this water to fish and relax. I also built that thing over there, a little shack on the side. Uh, there's an extra fridge in there. Might be a good spot for parties or something. Agent Red, when did you become so nice? I'm not. I just... You needed a place to stay, and you needed a new house since you lost your other one. So, yeah. <gasps> You care about me! No. No, I don't. Thank you so much. Can I get a hug? No, no hugs. Come on! Agency? I'm not a hugger. Just one? Fine. I don't do this for other people, so you're lucky. Like I said before, Agent Ren has always had a soft spot for me. But anyways, with a bunch more of the island to discover, who knows what's in store? We'll continue another time, but for now, I'll see you in the next story. You're so upset. 